Say I go by zip code slashes, and I'm the hardest artist of the week. You be that. Basically, six years ago, me and my friend, we got together on the music tip and started writing raps low key. I mean, inspired by other artists and local artists. I was inspired first by my dad. He was the first to show me like what rap was. Secondly, he showed me who Ace Mac was. He was a local joke. Thirdly, we got the One Away fam. They was around from where I'm from. So of course I had that around me. We got together and got serious with this music and about five years later, we got more and more in tune. Now we created our own record label and now we making our own music and our own productions. How far will my music go? Well, it's came a long way since when we first started at. I mean, from coming from rock bottom, we probably about <coughs> A little bit closer to where we could be, but to where it could be, we still haven't experienced that either. I mean, it still could go a long, long way, and I plan on making it go a long, long, long way. <laughs> Artists in the industry I'm trying to work with, basically, any real artist who speaks upon real events and life stuff, like the J. Coles and the Kanye's, and the, you know, who can speak upon real life facts and events and create an opinion on the crowd and population. Say so the basic message for anybody who's following in my footsteps is that you can do anything. Any human has the capability to do anything they could think of. They have it within themselves. I go by zip code slashes, Captain the MH made, the hardest artist of the week. I just want to drive in a car with a perfect wife And have money to spend and live a perfect life But that's something pretend Cause when you finally make it It's a whole nother line of haters try and take it But all bullshit aside Would it really take for a kid to be successful like Drizzy Drake? I don't want the fame I just want to get the cake And I'ma make it rain till we sitting in the lake I mean, I want to see how fame feel, but it seems living good famous just ain't real. And if that's so, I don't want to try it fast. I want to live life while it lasts. I'm 16, but tomorrow we'll never know. So should we quit dreams and should we let them go? Or should we hold on? What if it goes wrong? No matter what, gotta know life goes on. Yeah, it's that boy Zip.